Shinigami Lama here. No, no, no. Over here. Yeah, that's me. Yeah. I wanted to take a moment just to give a little idea of what will be on this particular channel. Obviously, each llama has its own preferences. In my particular case, you'll be seeing a lot of older games, a lot of obscure forgotten games, the occasional Steam game, actually a lot of Steam games, many of which are free, and some of which are glitched like that particular chest over there, but that's half the fun. And a nice little smattering of horror games, as well as games such as this. In terms of horror games, um, I would like suggestions on what you would like to see. However, I do not play any games that simulate or reproduce uh, the concept of stalking. This is due to the fact that I myself am a survivor, of, I guess you could say, of um, a stalking. So it's kind of not enjoyable for me. I know a lot of people do like games like Slender Man and things like that. That's all up on them. Yeah, correct. But, in, oh! Hello, it's one of mine. But in my particular case, it's just not something that uh, I enjoy. So with that in mind, I will be playing some games. Uh, I have a couple actually on the menu that are playthroughs. One example is ship our. Oh, I'd love to play the Shivers games. I don't know if anybody's heard of those. Um, Scratches is the one that comes to mind. I actually have that on my uh, agenda. Darkness Within and its sequel, Glitched, are both also on my uh, on my list of things to play. They're both very good. In fact, actually. A lot of the games I have lined up for you guys are very Lovecraftian in nature. There is uh, a Sherlock Holmes game called The Awakening, which again is uh, based on Lovecraft. And uh, while I don't intend this to be the Lovecraft channel, it is indeed almost a rite of passage to play games by uh, Mr. LC simply because of the fact that he was rather good at coming up with very suspenseful dark rather fun games I'll probably also be playing some games that uh, aren't normally seen on playthroughs I know there are a series of games based on Edgar Allan Poe. These are hidden object games, so they might not be what you would expect to see, but they're actually quite good. Along with that, uh, I will probably be playing some of the Mystery Case Files games. Very good. Uh, how shall I put it? Hidden object slash adventure, um, very horror oriented. Excellent, excellent games though. <clears throat> so you might be expecting some of that in the near future. Again, if you have anything you would particularly like to see, then definitely give me a heads up and. If I can find it, I will try and play it. Until then, don't let the mirrors get you, and try not to phase through your pets. Good evening, all.